Hey designers, Jessica here, and I'm going to walk you through um, how to load up and use your holiday freebies. So first of all, I have my file here open, and this is what your download is going to contain. First of all, um, there's going to be a README file in here, and I have uh, a link to my YouTube playlists in case you're not really familiar with using paintbrushes in Photoshop the mixer brush tools or the pattern stamp tools. You can check out my playlists for my products where I go over in detail how to use them. So I have first of all a playlist for the wet paint mixer brushes, second of all a playlist for the modern impressionist pattern brushes, and then also I've included some ping graphics in here that you can use for your projects and for personal or commercial use just like as if you bought them on um, Creative Market and here's a link to the license. And then if you like, there's a link to my Creative Market shop, my website, and my Instagram. So we've got the README file with a link to the YouTube. And then um, we have the mixer brushes that I've used in this demo, which come with a, first of all, you know, you've got your ABR brush here and if you just want to see what they can do out of the box, I've also got the tool preset file, which is essentially the ABR brush file that's already loaded with color for you. And then also very key, I have the mixer brush palettes, which are provided to you as a PSD file. And then we have the pattern brushes, which we have got the source ABR brush, and then we also have the pattern. So, I'm going to show you how you can take the pattern stamp tool, use your ABR brush with the pattern um, to paint these multicolor strokes. Or I also have the tool preset, which is basically the ABR brush that's already loaded with the pattern colors. So I've got, um, I'll have you covered on all the bases, however you like to use them. And then I have the ping graphic folder. And this has got the little graphics that I created for this demo and saved as a ping with transparency so that you can use them in whatever program you like, even if you don't uh, have Photoshop or use the brushes. So to load these, um, first off, you can just double click them. And I'll just do that right now. So that's going to be the loaded tool presets that double click the ABR brushes. Pattern brushes will go in here. Double click the tool presets, double click the ABR, double click the patterns. So those are gonna be loaded, but I'm also going to show you how to load them manually in Photoshop. <clears throat> and then the ping graphics you can open up in whatever program you like. So I have Photoshop here, and I'm just going to go to my brush panel. If you don't have it, you go to Windows Brushes. And in the brushes, I've double clicked these. So I've got my um, brushes already loaded here. This is the mixer brushes. And this is the um, brush, the ABR brush for the pattern stamp tool. And uh, I have the latest version, so they're in folders here automatically. Or we can go in the brush panel, go to the right hand, top right, and click, uh, import brushes, or if you're having an older one, it might say load brushes. And then we're gonna go to the desktop here. And I've got the mixer brushes, so I can click on these and click open. That's going to load those up. And then right click up on the top right here, import brushes or load brushes. And I can go to my pattern brush tool and load those brushes up, click open. So that's the brushes. The tool presets, these are already loaded. We've got the mixer ones and the pattern stamp tool. And in case you're not familiar with tool presets, they're just like, they're just uh, some tools that have already have some special properties. Uh, in this case, they're brushes, but they've already been loaded with either the pattern or the color in the, um, in the case of the mixer brushes. So, if you want to load up the tool presets, we're gonna to go to load tool presets and let's go to my file desktop. And here for the mixer brushes, we'll click open 
and that's those again and click load tool presets go to the desktop and we can load up those pattern stamp tool presets which is those three multicolored light kind of glow things so those are all loaded up and if I have um, my pattern stamp tool here selected we can go here and we see that I already have my patterns loaded up but in case there you want to load them manually you can go to the pattern stamp tool click up here and click on this gear and click load patterns and here is the source patterns in the file so can that's to how to load them up manually so those are everything loaded I'm also going to go into the mixer brushes here and double click and open up this um, mixer brush palette and here we have the three palettes that I was um, that I've given you that you'll need to use from and we'll select the palettes later so this is uh, what we're going to use to pick up the color for the mixer brushes so right now I have a file open it's an RGB color space um, which is important for the mixer brushes because those are uh, RGB and then you can convert it later if you're going to print it but um, the RGB palettes if you're going to pick up that color in RGB you'll need to paint it in RGB as well so I have an empty um, uh, document here and I'm going to show you the basics of using these brushes in the next part